Hi, Henry Johnson here from dietsandmealplans.com. Today I'm going to talk to you about calories and what they really are. You know, we always hear about calories whenever we talk about dieting and diets. But what are they and what do they do? Well, calories, they are actually a terminology of energy stored in food. So whenever you take in food, whether it's a vegetable or it's a chocolate bar, it contains a certain amount of calories. Now, if you take in too many calories, let's say more calories than you need, then the excess energy or excess calories will be stored in the body as fat. Fat is actually energy depots in the body and it's fat we want to get rid of. So we want to dig deep down and burn that fat. So how do we do that? Well, most diets are actually based on the calorie intake in food. So you aim to go for uh, meals that fill up your stomach but holds low calories so that in the essence you will have a minus of calories you will have fewer calories taken in each day than what the body spends now an average adult uses around 2500 to 2200 calories a day it varies a lot depending on size age and the activity of the person not to forget so in order to determine how many calories you would spend use during a day, you would have to cal calculate your age, your height, your weight, and combine uh, things like what you do. Are you a plumber or are you an office clerk? It depends a lot. But the first thing you want to do is to take a look at your food and read on the food wrapping what amount of calories there are in the food. All food wrapping contains information on the calorie amount or you can go on the internet and you can find information on the calorie content in vegetables and fruits for instance this bad boy here a piece of chocolate contains it's on the wrapper contains 98 calories in this bar here so it's good information to know if you're on a calorie diet but you can't just cut out calories completely and cut down to like 1200 calories a day if your body needs 2500 of course you would see a weight loss rather fast but it would slow your metabolism down and you would eventually gain weight or not lose any weight so what you want to do is to find that fine balance find out exactly what your body needs and just stay just below that limit not too far on just below the limit and you want to combine that with the workouts exercise running swimming spinning, aerobics, you name it, whatever you prefer. You want to combine that. What you also want to make sure is that you get enough minerals and vitamins so you do not deplete your body of those because that could cause some serious health problems. So calories are just a tool and you would see it mentioned in almost every diet that you read of. But knowing what calories are and what they do is really important. So I hope that uh, you were enlightened by this little video or you're welcome to read more at uh, my webpage at www.dietsandmealplans.com You can just follow the link in this video and it will take you right there and you will find a lot of uh, diets and information on calories. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you found it useful. Thank you.